Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all the baby items that I um, have come to find that we just never used, something that we um, wasted our money on basically. So the first thing I would say is baby shoes. Now, we bought a lot of like little baby tiny shoes um, for Harrison and they were just pointless. We wasted our money on them because he never wore them. They just look so uncomfortable on him and you know they can't walk so it's just a bit pointless really there to put a shoe on a baby and you know they didn't fit very well and they'd just fall off so yeah i would definitely say little baby shoes just are a waste of money and they're just not needed so in relation to shoes clothes as well i would say spending too much money and buying a load of baby clothes. They're just not needed. And especially like little outfits like jeans and shirts, that kind of thing. We spent quite a bit of money on like jeans and things, like little cute outfits. And we also got given loads of stuff like that as well. We very rarely put them in him, um, like put him in like jeans and things. Cause you know, it's nice to put them on them to take a picture and they look cute and stuff. But he did, he very rarely wore them for like more than an hour or something because he just looks so uncomfortable in like, you know, like they don't fit very well, they're just, they're just too big for them. And yeah, I just thought that that was a waste of money to buy like jeans and shirts and all like little cute outfits. Like, don't get me wrong, they, they are cute and if you want to buy that sort of thing then that's fine. But for me personally, we just thought there was no point because when I was going through Harrison's clothes not long ago and I was getting rid of things um, to pack away for like, to make room for the next size clothes. I was like, there's so many clothes with the tags on that he's never worn. And I just think we went a bit too crazy with like, in regards to clothes. So I would definitely say, turn it down on the spending. They don't need that many clothes because they just won't wear them. I mean, I know you're probably thinking, lots of nappy changes, lots of clothes changes. They might have explosions. Yes, you probably will change the clothes a lot, but I just put Harrison in like baby girls all the time, like sleep suits most of the time. So especially like when he was a tiny baby. So yeah, I'd definitely say not to spend your money on loads of clothes and like little baby shoes and like jeans and shirts, that kind of thing. So the next thing that I regret buying is, now obviously I need, you need a baby monitor, but I regret buying this particular brand of baby monitor because we just had so many problems with it from the get go. Um, but I only bought it because I heard lots of good things about it and recommendations and because it was quite cheap and um, it, well it wasn't cheap cheap but it wasn't ex as expensive as other brand. So the particular one is this brand of baby monitor, Harrison's asleep so that's why it's on. <laughs> um, it's the Motorola one, this is actually a brand new one because James ended up buying a brand new one but we've just had so many different problems with it um from like charging we had to have it constantly on charge because it only lasts like up to an hour um the battery would only last an hour and um, so i'm constantly having to have the wire plugged in which i'm not really a fan of and um, so after an hour it would start beeping that it's losing its battery life um, and then it just kind of broke i mean we've had it for over a year so it has lasted but the fact that it's broke after a year which is just annoying and we've had to buy a brand new one which i wasn't so over the keen on the idea i did tell james to buy a completely different brand but he went and bought the same one yeah i just regret buying it it's just naff we've had so many problems with it and i just don't recommend buying the Motorola uh, baby monitors. So the next thing I regret buying is uh, like a little baby bouncer. Now, a lot of people recommended me to buy them because obviously you can put your baby in them like to sleep and stuff in the daytime. Um, and you know, it's quite nice and um, like you can bounce them to sleep in it, that kind of thing. I think we literally put Harrison in his like little baby bouncer a handful of times and he just didn't like it. Um, so for me personally, I probably won't be buying one again for any future babies because we just didn't use it. Um, it was a waste of money. Um, I think we actually, I don't actually think we bought it ourselves to be honest. I think we got it gifted to us like from family uh, at my baby shower. But personally, I wouldn't go out of my way to buy one. Um, I just think there's no point. We did end up buying him a little swingy chair, which is like, you can put batteries in it and it like swings. Um, that I would definitely recommend, but the baby bouncer, we just didn't use it. So I definitely would recommend not buying one personally for me. 
it was just a waste of it would just be a waste of money so the next thing i regret buying is like a little play mat now i did put harrison in a play mat a couple of times but thinking back now i didn't he did didn't use it like every day, I didn't put him in it every day, and um, the odd handful of times I did, but I think after like a couple of weeks, it just got pushed in his room and never got used. Um, so yeah, I probably wouldn't buy that again. I regret buying it because it was just a waste of money. He didn't know how to use it. Another thing that I regret buying is baby mobile. Is that what they're called? You know, the things that you put on the cot and they hang over and you can turn them on and they play music. Well. We put one of them on Harrison's cot and he wasn't in his cot until six months in his room. So it didn't get used for six months um, because it wouldn't attach to his next to me crib um, snooze pod. It wouldn't go on there. To be honest, I didn't use it. Like um, I didn't wind it up or anything to play the music because he had other means of white noise. So really it was just pointless buying. I just think it was a waste of money. Like. He didn't get used it's just there for decoration and it's now not even on his cart because he doesn't like it he just messes with it he just wants to pull it off so yeah i definitely would probably not buy one of them again another yeah. thing that i regret buying is something that i think i used once and um, those little things it's like a little net a little mesh thing and you can use you use it for weaning and you can put like the fruit and things in so that they can like suck on the on the fruit and stuff um i just forgot buying it because they just were so like fiddly to clean and harrison wasn't really interested in them and um yeah i just think they were a waste of money um i definitely wouldn't recommend buying them they just we didn't use them they just got put in the bin definitely wouldn't buy those again so they were just a few things that i regret buying you might um love them Personally, I didn't like these things that I bought and I definitely regret buying them. I wouldn't buy them again Personally, they just didn't work for us and we just didn't use them. They were just a waste of our money But I hope you enjoyed this video guys Please give it a big thumbs up because it will let me know that you enjoyed this kind of video and I can do more kind of videos like this I don't know why I keep doing this with my hands, but you know <laughs> Yeah, don't forget to subscribe before you leave guys. It's free. Why not join me on my channel? I would absolutely love it if you subscribe to my channel. It would make my day um, And yeah, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you in my next one. Bye